My name is Juan Antonio Sandoval, and I have the affliction of collecting art. My collection is actually considered to be, according to a book over there by Dr. Vargas, one of the largest collections in the Southwest. I was very young. My father drew. He only had a fourth grade education because his school burned down and it was never rebuilt. So I learned to appreciate drawing from him. And I think that kind of ignited my passion or my interest in art. disease. Since the exhibition opened, I've acquired, let me see, 12 pieces. Now when they return the artwork, I definitely will have no place to put a lot of it. Siempre había querido este artista, pero sale muy caro, 180 dólares. Porque es una porcelana de la más delgadita. Le gusta hacer la cerámica y luego se, como se encoge, así la de. Ah, I'm speaking Spanish. Díganme, si me olvido. I forget when I'm in Spanish or in English. Or, o cesate di piagarme luce in grande. Ino gi mi gi kashi koise o tu me. Or, then my herz begin to clean and turn in my neklingen. Which language do you want? Quali di oma kere? No. People say I have more artwork in my bathroom than most people have in their homes. I mean, the first time I could afford to buy a piece of art. I have it hanging in one of those rooms over there. I had a friend, Leona Wellington, her mother was from Costa Rica, and she needed money desperately. So I bought a little tiny uh, lithograph for $25. And then I discovered you could buy art very inexpensively. See, a lot of people might consider this house to be a disaster because they want the uh, art to go very well behind the couch. I call it uh, couch art. They want the colors to match up and da 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 da. That makes for a very boring house. Do you want to peek in that one? Francisco Toledo, he's a great patron of the arts in Oaxaca. And he built a paper factory where there was an old textile factory with lots of water. So a lot of the natives there are able to, they collect plants and they make kites, which they used to sell to the tourists. They still make them. There's art everywhere. I collect a lot of textiles. There's a woman, I buy a lot of her work. And this is actually this beautiful brown color. That's the natural color of cotton that grows in Oaxaca. They cultivate it. And then this is cochinilla, which is made from, I have some in here. It's called grana cochinilla. I could have had a fancy car. I could have had very nice clothing. I could have had da 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 da. But I, but I think the joy of my life has been helping other people. Because we don't take anything to our graves, you know. 